Howdy and welcome to another video edition of Remedy Land. Today I want to talk to you about Glen Shunt surgery. Glen Shunt is a temporary treatment that is applied on children, preceding the Fontan procedure, to improve blood flow to the lungs, where only one ventricle is working properly and the other is much smaller and does not send enough blood to the body and lungs. Glen shunt is surgery in which the superior vena cava is connected to the right pulmonary artery in order to send the blood right in the lung and pass away heart and his thin ventricle that prevents proper blood flow. Glen shunt is trying to evade completely inadequate heart and his is sometimes applied to both lungs and then is called the bidirectional Glen shunt. Who need Glen shunt surgery? Patients who need Glen Shunt are those who suffer from a congenital heart defect and signs by which one can recognize are the bluish skin, lips and fingernails, which occur due to deficiency of oxygen in the blood. Glen Shunt is palliative type of surgery that does not correct the problem and he is performed on open heart. Surgeon makes a small incision in the chest after which the patient stays in the hospital a couple of days. After successfully Glen Shunt procedure, Fontan procedure is a logical extension but they are not performed together, because they can make a big pulmonary pressure. The great advantage of Glen Shunt is that this procedure is able to perform very early on children and thereby improve their quality of life. The downside of Glen Shunt is that in some children there is increased pulmonary pressure which leads to more problems. Advantage of bidirectional Glen Shunt over classic Glen Shunt the classic Glen shunt is now very rare because exceed of the bidirectional Glen shunt surgery. Bidirectional Glen shunt is usually a second behind Blalock Taussig surgery which is performed on newborn babies. The advantage of bidirectional Glen shunt procedure is that she allows the flow of blood with the lack of oxygen to the both lungs and does not affect pulmonary artery tree. This is an advantage for the continuation by reason that Fontan procedure requires intact pulmonary artery tree. Another advantage is that this type of Glen shunt operation is that does not cause consequences for lung blood vessel, which can narrow and thicken due to increased pulmonary pressure. Glen shunt is a very safe operation but death can occur in some situations. After Glen shunt, over time, there may be the reappearance of cyanotic episodes and peripheral saturation, in some cases, that can lead to infection and pericardial or pleural effusions. I hope you've enjoyed this video edition. We'll see you again on another video edition of Remedy Land. Take care.